At 530, bed bugs at Wayne State University have caused one building on campus to close its doors. And it's forcing students to make other arrangements this weekend while the university deals with it. 7 Action News reporter Mike Woolfolk on the campus with details. There is a sign on the door that says the Schiffman Medical Library will be closed this weekend for what it describes as unexpected maintenance. 7 Action News has learned that that maintenance has to do with bed bugs. For students wanting to study here this weekend, the inconvenience is temporary but necessary after someone reported bed bugs inside the library. We had somebody come in. Uh, they did confirm the presence of bed bugs, so we're going to do a deep clean over the weekend, make sure the situation is eradicated, and we'll be open for business again on Monday. Has this ever happened before? According to Matt Lockwood, yes. This past February, when somebody reported bed bugs in a cubicle, they brought in actually a bed bug sniffing dog, and uh, they did not find the presence of any bed bugs. None were ever found. But he says the cubicle was fumigated anyway. Students using the library on Friday would not speak on camera, but tell me bed bugs concern them, and they're glad the university is taking steps to deal with it. We take it very seriously. We get a report like this, we're going to react quickly and uh, take the appropriate steps to minimize the impact on our students. And in this case, Lockwood says minimizing that impact is made easier by the timing. It is late July, and most students who would be using the facility are not yet back on campus. In Detroit, Mike Wolfolk, 7 Action News. So, what do you do if you think you may have taken bed bugs home with you? Do not sleep in another bed, sofa, or stay with someone else. The bed bugs may follow you to these locations, making it even harder to contain. Do save any bed bugs that you find. You may need to show it to your landlord or pest control professionals. Don't assume that you are the only one being bitten because some people do not react to bed bug bites at all. And do start dealing with your clothing and linens. Wash on hot and dry on hot to ensure that the bed bugs are killed. And absolutely do not use a fogger or bug comb. This could actually spread bed bugs.